The cost of haircuts at barber shops these days seems like they've just gone through the roof. They are so expensive anymore. So, when you go to the barber shop, make sure you get your money's worth. Make sure you get the haircut you want. Make sure you put that barber to the test. You make sure they earn every dime you give them for that haircut. Personally, when I go to the barber shop, I don't really get my money's worth. I feel like I spend way more than they actually work because they don't have a whole lot to do on my head. They just trim me up a little bit or done. They say, how short do you want to go? And I'll probably say, oh, give me a one because, you know, one's a very, very short haircut. Maybe a two. Whatever. I don't really care. I just get a little shaggy sometimes. I want to trim. And I'm starting to think I need to just get my own my own trimmers and do it myself but if you have a full head of hair make them work for that money make them work for it don't settle for less if you're not happy with what they do say no I'm not happy with this do a little more do a little more even if you are happy just to make sure they are earning that money make them work a little harder and if you don't like it say to them no Start over. Just start completely over. Give me a brand new haircut. I am paying for this. You need, as a service provider, yes, haircutters are providing a service, of course. Haircutting is a service. So make sure you get what you want. Other places where you would expect the same thing, right? You get in a taxi cab, you expect that taxi cab driver to take you where you're going. They're not going to just drop you off a mile from your destination and say, well, this is close enough, you can walk from here. They're not going to do that. So why would a barber not give you the haircut you envision, that you want, that you desire, that you need maybe. Maybe there's a policy your company has and you have to have your hair really short. Don't settle for less. Get your money's worth at the barber shop just like you would anywhere else. You go to the dentist, you're going to pay money. Maybe your insurance is taking care of this. Maybe this isn't the best example, but if you're paying out of pocket they're not going to just drill a hole in your tooth and say oh we're done no they're going to drill a hole and then they're going to fill it or whatever they do whatever you go to the dentist for you know better than i do maybe you're getting a crown but they're not just going to file your tooth out and say okay bye no they're going to finish the job aren't they and you're going to pay out of pocket for that unless your insurance provides i don't know but don't be like me, paying a lot of money for hardly anything. Get your money's worth. Tell them to just start over if you're not happy with what they have done. Don't get up out of that chair until you are completely happy with what you see in the mirror. Or if you're with somebody who is supervising the barber, perhaps. Perhaps you brought somebody along to supervise the haircut. Make sure they're happy. And if they're not happy, the barber should not be paid. Do not pay any barber or beautician until you are satisfied. Get your money's worth at the barber shop. On a foo -foo haircut, sitting on my head. Sitting on my head